a haunting search for the unknown. Paranormal investigator Mark Wallbank has had a lifelong interest in supernatural phenomena since he was just 10 years old. I've always been into the paranormal. I've always been into ghosts and UFOs, especially the unexplained mysteries out there. Um, because they were unexplained, that fascinated me more. The 56-year-old founded Paranormal New Zealand in 1984. We sort of straddle that line of you know, believer and sceptic as well. So we're kind of in the middle and we're, we're waiting for things to happen and things do happen and it's up to us to try and figure it out. Wallbank and his team of seven investigators have camped out in haunted houses, searched for ghosts and travelled the globe in pursuit of supernatural stories. We're not ghost hunters, we're not ghost busters, we're not exorcists um, or anything like that. Um, none of us in the team are sort of religious in any way. We don't sort of bring any of that. We're basically just a bunch of people that have an interest. The author of Haunted Auckland is currently working on his fifth book, Haunted South. The search continues. He's reaching out online for credible ghost stories to add to the project. I've just had so much come in. It's just incredible. And I've been talking to people via this um, through Messenger and all that. And um, it's just been fascinating. The stories are incredible. Wallbank says Christchurch has its share of ghost stories. I've covered things like, you know, Ballantines, you know, the old, the big fire. And I mean, since then, there's been a lot of um, activity there in, in the building. Um, yeah, the Christchurch Hospital, you know, the Rickerton Hotel. The paranormal investigator insists a lot of the sightings are quite subtle. Nothing like you'd see on TV or the movies. Nobody really knows the true answers and the facts. And while paranormal investigators and researchers, we, we have our theories and we have our opinions and we have our findings and our conclusions or whatever, skeptics and the scientific community, they will have their theories and opinions about it as well. But neither are right. They're just opinions and theories. Wallbank's busy compiling the large amount of submitted haunting stories he's received, aiming to release his Haunted South book in November. In Christchurch, the South Today.